And you're looking at a superstar who comes into this match as a reigning champion. You can just tell he's got some extra swagger to him, knowing he's a title holder. To be a champion, you have to be among the best. He knows he's currently at the top of his game. And in this match, he's got a chance to once again prove that fact. Yeah, but anybody that is sky high, he knew that was coming. Going counter for counter. Elias gets intercepted. Oh boy. I don't care what the reasoning is. There was no call for that. Oh God, face first. Elias with the retaliation. Vicious right forearm. Getting him into the corner. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Golly. And we know Elias can play a mean tune, but what does he have? Penny predicament, shoulders down. We'll need to get a little more to put this one away. DDT! Planet. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Cross landing, powerbomb. And Elias is on the downside of things right now. And Elias needs to figure things out quick. Oh, foot just stomping down. He reverses it. Elias is pushing back now. Elias finding an answer for that burst of attacks against him. Piercing elbow drop. Vicious right forearm. Well placed kick to the gut. Another damaging Bang. kick. Oh, and a close line to follow. Elias may be thinking high risk. From way up. Oh no! Crashing hard onto the floor. Was trying to. Here we go. Cross body. Whoa. That is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. No fear. Absolute reckless abandon. He may be in a bad way here. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out yet. This match could still go either way. Clothesline takes him down. Forget about it. Strong punch to the midsection. Military press. Ooh. From the top, ah! down. Up across the shoulder. Uh oh. Range down an elbow retaliation. Seeing an answer for every move attempted. Oh, this gets close. Lock Talk their head off. He's looking a little weary now. At this stage of the match, they are clearly starting to feel the effects of this back and forth. Measured knee drop. Elias doing more than carrying a tune. And Elias leaning on that power offense to move firmly into the advantage. He might be. Elias looking for. Just away. Elias was right on target. coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Measured knee drop. Holy moly, amazing display of athleticism. We might be close to the end. Not what you want to see by any means. Arise, 
Sheamus is in a bad spot here, guys, but we all know how quickly he can change his suit. He just can't hold one. Put in a position now. Oh, not a power bomb onto the apron. Hammering down on the knee. And Elias is on the downside of things right now. And Elias needs to figure things out quick. Whip back into the ring. Up the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. We're gonna finish it off. Slow time bomb. Elias' eyes look glazed over. Makes the cover. Oh, he kicked out. I do not know how they got up from that. Operating on pure instinct and adrenaline right now. That was plan A, and it didn't work. He must be thinking about plan B at this point. It is unbelievable what these athletes have been putting each other through. Absolutely pushing each other beyond any normal human's limits. He avoids the damage. He just keeps dealing out punishment with every move. This could be his moment for the win. Two. Man, that was such a long and hard-fought match. He earned that victory. Here is your winner, Jeff Hardy. A big win, and the celebration has begun. Well, no one's going to be walking with Elias tonight, I can tell you that much. Ricochet has said he's modeled his career after some of the most precise superstars in WWE history. Well, Ricochet can study them, but it doesn't make him them. But it certainly makes him up for the challenge. Expect to see Ricochet's precision at work tonight. But he'll be facing off against the ever-electric Rick Boogs. The only thing bigger than his personality might be his muscles, Corey. Off they go! That'll jam your tailbone. Ricochet just so unpredictable. All the way up. Still up. Squatting too, my gosh. Wow. An agile escape. What a pump kick. He was elusive there. a perfectly placed target. Shoulders down. And there's a kick out at one. Trying to make short order of things there. Hoist it up. Nice suplex. Vertical suplex. You'd have to guess that taking on Ricochet means focusing all your attention on his aerial game. Yeah, but that would be a mistake. Ricochet isn't a guy who's all sizzle and no steak. He's a fundamentally sound athlete. He can throw hands, he can grapple. He just happens to excel in the air second to none. Ricochet is a moving target. Look at this. Absolutely incredible by Ricochet. Ricochet hoists him up. Launched into a roundhouse kick. Slips out of the way. The strength of that slam. And he's out of there in a nick of time. To the outside. This could get wild. That one scouted. Carefully measured knee drop. Kicks out the knee. Watch this. This is breathtaking. And a dead look into the giant suplex. Wow. That is the kind of move that leaves our jaws on the floor. Unbelievable. Turned around Ricochet's attack. 
And he gets set back into the ring. for a quick kick out. Oh, kick right in the face. Firm control. Yeah. Standing shooting star press. Incredible. He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. No. Barrel roll to Bay. Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke, and it pays off. And what he's looking for here he looks like a potential submission maneuver coming. Oh, I'm going to tap out here, but it ain't going to matter. We'll still do a lot of... Oh, what a reversal and counter by him. Nice takedown. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. We could have been looking at a count out there. Yeah, you just know that would have been a deflating result for the WWE Universe. This the dog snap suplex so quick. And the cover! And a strong oh. kick out in one. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. Carefully plays stomp to the arm. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Oh, a line of a kick to the back. What are we going to see here? Oh, back, back, face buster. No one does it better. So stop it. Does Ricochet need to do tonight? He's given everything, but still hasn't ended this. Oh, man, right to the esophagus. I don't know how there's anything left in these superstars' bodies. Yeah, the tank is being emptied tonight. If this works, it could change the course of the match. Uh uh. No way. Ricochet with a shooting star. Ricochet proving just how precise he can be there. Thread through a needle. Ricochet ready to strike. 630 splash from Ricochet. But can Ricochet close this? The cover. Two. Oh, not yet. They just got the shot the rock. Oh, that was more than close. That was inches away from three. Millimeters. Ricochet is really going to have to show his heart here. Needs to keep the pressure on. He just barely dodges. finding these reserves. How did he kick out of that? That was a golden opportunity to end things. Now he's got to hope the opportunity presents itself again. Just cranking the head. Listen to this place. He's heading up top. Thinking big. Launcher. And oh, he's there. Great awareness from Ricochet. Uses the edge of the knee. A torturous knee. Moonsault. Big boots, a 
Put it all tied up. Do a little rocket in the process. Rick Boogs, outrageous power. of a second. It's that time in the match where we all take a trip on the Boos Cruise. Exclamation delivered by Boos. It's over and Rick Boos is your winner. Here is your winner, Rick. What an incredible match. One we won't soon forget. This is a victory you could truly be proud of. A victory earned through sheer tenacity and force of will. The very domineering Ridge Holland will start this one off, and he might end it quickly, too. Not many superstars are made of Yorkshire steel like Ridge Holland. This guy was around for about five seconds before he got recruited to SmackDown, and with power and aggression like that, I'd say it was five seconds too long. Five seconds might be the length of this match if Holland has his way. And he's stepping into the ring with Ilya Dragunov, who's about as unpredictable as it gets. They call him the Mad Russian, and he literally thinks that he's invincible. He doesn't just think he's invincible. Dragunov is convinced that he is invincible. And if you've seen the competition he's gone toe-to-toe -to -toe with, you might just agree with him. Crank in the head. Ooh, a planted knee. Ouch. Escape just in time. to the three count there. He's returning fire. Ridge Holland, a two-pound superstar. Is his key to victory really as simple as I think it is? What's that, hit the guy hard until he stops moving? Yeah, I'd say it is. Ridge doesn't need to get too fancy in this one. Power is his biggest attribute, so, you know, don't overcomplicate things. And that toss sent them soaring. Dragunov not appearing so invincible there. A oh, bear hug, squeezing the breath out of him. Oh, he's in complete control. The bear hug cinched in. Gotta find a way out and catch your breath. Look at this, no quit whatsoever. Ready down elbows and escaping the bear hug. Double arm lock. I really can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. He thinks he has it. Kick out of one. That's still a quick kick out at this point. Ridge thinking big. From way up. Oh, Ridge caught by the counter. He's able to fend off the attack. These two trading counters, an absolute master class. Well, that is a sign that definitely gets the point across. And they burst out of barricade. Holland able to evade. Lined him up. Oh, and a forearm. Isolating the leg. Leg breaker. I am the counter. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. He's testing fate here in danger of a countout. Put into place. Suplexes, slams, and bombs are all painful, but being slapped like that is humiliating. You would know, Saxton. You have 
to think this match is starting to take its toll. Rich Hall is better than a trap suplex. Rich. His shoulders are down. He narrowly avoids the count. And frustration might be starting to set in. the job done tonight. You can tell this guy was fired up from the moment the bell rang. He definitely had the motivational advantage in this match. They call Gunther the ring general, a moniker he earned for the impressive combat tactics he employs in his matches. Tactics which can be as devastating as they are genius. You could easily mistake Gunther for a big Austrian brute, but he's a very cerebral competitor. Before he even... Set to the outside. Looking for his next form of attack. That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Oh! Down to Bonin, and a double axe handle smash. Oh, man, meeting the barricade. Uh-oh. not about the ref's count, Cole. And he tosses it back in now. Makes it back just in time. Oof, that was really close. There's the takedown. This could be it. Cover. He got close there. It could be. He thinks he has it. Kicks out on the pinfall attempt. Frankly, he should have known that wasn't enough. Oh, what a boot. And Bate perhaps tripped up by his inexperience there. That shows you the ring general's genius in action. Oof, a loving blow to the chest. The fire has been lit inside of Gunther. Gunther clearly has a strategy in mind here, and he's putting it into action with decisive attacks. Flipping the script on him there. Uncorks a thunderous chop. Powerless position to be in right now. Straight up down the throat. The cover, shoulders down. And he gets the shoulder up before two. And those kickouts are only going to get harder. Vicious right forearm. Be careful not to get go to her from behind. Looking to cinch it in. This one may be over. Good night. Tap out. Do it now. Live the fight. He's got him down. Is this it? A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. Not nah, good. They're putting it together. Sidewalk slam. This best trouble for Bate. Shoulder up before three. Wow, looks like this book has a couple more chapters in it. We might be seeing a whole saga written tonight. And Guther definitely thought that would put him down. I can't imagine he's going to take it easy on him after such a defiant kick out. From the top, how's that for a counter? Oh. Suplex 
Here it comes. Nicely done. An unrelenting assault being brought to Bate. Bate has to wake up and fast. Tyler is going to look to press on the advantage. Bate was being tested, but shows the resiliency to battle back. Tyler Bate looking to lock it in. Here's the Billy Goes curse is in effect. Oh, I can't stand this move. Oh, what a great escape. Oh, he fights Bate back.
to the outside now. And he gets delivered back into the ring. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. The WWE Universe, where are these superstars are? Gunther wants to finish this. truly intense match. This win is spreading like a wildfire. The electricity in this arena is almost palpable. Four superstars battling it out in this fatal four-way. No count-outs in this match really allows Phil to most action outside the ring as inside the ring. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. He deflects it right back. for a timeout. You don't get any timeouts in a fight. That's just running away. Hooked up. DDT. Oh, now oh, oh, he knew what was coming. Big knee. And right between the shoulder blades. And we just saw some serious to do. Solo making sure his opponent knows what his intentions are. Falcon Arrow! Oh man, he is fired up now. He is just reeling from that offense. Yeah, but at this point, Paul, the Fatal 4 is still anyone's to win. This is not going to end well. Oh, jarring impact. Ooh. He is delivering elbow after elbow. 
And now thrown back into the ring. Up handle applied. Into a gut buster. Nice. <laughs> Solo Sokoa standing ten toes down, ready to fight. The steel chair. Looks like he's opted to go with the simple but effective statement here. This will be bad for him. Rod Breaker daring his opponent to try the odds. Back in under the ropes. Here he goes for the win. What an interference. Ow. And he saw that coming from Braun. What a headbutt. He gets back into the ring. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Beautiful chop block.
over and over, establishing complete control. Looking for something, anything under the ring. Stay up, now attack. Roman Mark here, up in the suplex. Oh, no. Oh, He's looking for something. This could get dangerous. A steel chair? Something we all know can be a devastating weapon. Oh, my God, a steel chair! Surprised to not even get a two count at this point. Vicious right for him. Big impact off the neck breaker. Door for a European arm breaker. Oh, I think we're going to see it. Here it comes. Suspense this crowd is feeling is palpable. They are waiting with bated breath for what's to come next. Fishing for something beneath the ring. Oh no, come on, don't use a sledgehammer. Think of the children. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. A powerful suplex toss. Oh. Quick oh. strike to the lower body. Saw that one coming. And look at this now, yes, applying the submission hold. And you imagine what it would do to his confidence if he tapped out right. The cross arm bar was locked in good, but a great counter there. Time up and a headbutt from behind. Pele kick. for these superstars to get to this point. I think these fans are driving in the crowd an extra inch. You can so survive these fans. And the cover for the win. This is it. Oh, no. Dangerous maneuver there. The Kamura. The Kamura. Kamura lock applied. Will they tap? Oh, no. This is not one. He doesn't have much time before his arm snaps. ladies and gentlemen. With a superstar in every corner, we knew this would be spectacular. I am floored by what we saw here tonight.